In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to do bows for the Sailor Scout uniform. I'm using pink fabric because I'm doing Sailor Jupiter. Um, adjust your fabric color accordingly to your Scout. And I use a satin material. It's very shiny. I think it's going to add to the look of the costume extremely well. Get about a yard and a half of a satin fabric in the color you like. I also put interfacing on the front of each of the bows. Half a yard would do you fine. So this is the patterns for my bow. I sketched them out. So I'm going to scan these and put them on my DeviantArt again just like I did for the pattern for the crown. So check the description below for the link for that. And then taking your patterns, you're going to want to cut out all the pieces onto your fabric for the bows. So for the front of the bow, I have the bow front and the bow back that goes on the chest. And then I have the front of the bow and the tails of the bow that goes on the back of the uniform. And for both of the front of the bows, I cut out the pink fabric and I also am going to line it with some stiffener. And now as we're sewing the fronts of both of the bows together, how you want to layer your fabric is both the right sides are together, so the shiny sides of the satin are together pinned, and then the interfacing is on the back side of either one. So go ahead and sew these together, leaving about a 2-3 inch gap all the way around the edge, and then fold it right side out. So see what we did here? There's my opening, stitched all the way around. It's a straight stitch, so cut the corner off, and then I do little snips like this. So, go ahead and turn it right side out. And always, always press your seam, so go ahead and iron this flat. Ta-da! Nice and ironed and smooth. Now, always, 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 I do a really fine top stitch over the whole thing. It just makes everything look really clean and nice and lays flat. It'll also close up the gap you have left from when you turned it right side out. So do this for all of your bow pieces. So now we have everything pressed and top stitched. Okay, we're gonna start with the front bow. We're going to take the front of the front bow, follow me here, and just start folding it and scrunching it together. So pretty much I try to take the middle, so line the two edges together and hold the middle, and then take the sides and just fold them back and forth. I forgot to push record on my stupid iPad, so sorry I kind of missed a step here. but. This is the front, this is the back. I did the same thing to the back, just scrunched it up, and now I'm sewing them together. And because there's so much material and thickener between this, I'm having to use a pair of pliers to pull my needle through. I'm gonna do it three times. One, two, three. So now once you have this all sewed together, we're gonna take the front little rectangle piece you cut and just wrap it around. Just put the ugly end down below and the finished edge up on the top. The seam is back here. Make sure it's on the back so you're not going to see it. Don't put it up on the top or anything. So there we have it kind of set in place. I'm going to take my needle go from the back so you can't see the knot. Just kind of wrap it around a few times and secure the two edges together. Ta-da! It's the front bow! Oh, so pretty! Do the same thing for the back bow. And it's a little easier since you only have one layer to work with. There's no back. So just scrunch up the front layer and secure it with the middle rectangle. And then you have your two long tails to attach to the back bow. So they're going to be attached like this to the back. I'm going to attach them right here on the edges of the middle loop. Right there. So just hand sew those on. Front bow, back bow, front bow, back bow, yeah! So now you have completed bows. Two different styles for the front and the back. I'm doing the newer sailor uniform. I don't know if it's newer, I don't know. But it's the one that has the heart on the front, not the circle, and so the back bows are these long strings. The older, more classic, I don't know how to differentiate between the two, but the older ones, I'm going to stick with that have the front and the back bow the same. So if you're doing that version with the circled jewel instead of the heart, um, just do two of these instead of one of these and one of these. Got it? Okay, we're done. Get back in here. Where's you going? Angel? Angel? 